Hi everyone, Kelsey here with Virtual Christmas Extravaganza video number 13. As a reminder, this video is part of a Christmas themed, project based, new fabric video series and video number 13 concludes this virtual extravaganza that is Christmas themed. I'm very grateful for all of you who have watched and followed along with me. I can't wait to show you everything that's new in video number 13. So let's have a good time looking at the new fabrics and projects. First, we're going to start out with the beautiful giant Nomantics quilt. It finishes out at about 65 and a half inches by 74 and a half inches. And of course, it's too big for my studio area, so we had to fold it down. But as you can see on the left side, it does feature a beautiful um, border print all the way around. And Kathy made this for us, so I'm gonna read a little bit about the quilt in Kathy's words. Um, she says, since the project calls for two panels, the quilt is very easy to assemble. This also gives you the opportunity to size it down while keeping the same cute design. Use one panel or a partial panel and turn it into a wall hanging, table topper, or throw. She did try to fussy cut the corners and then realize that there was no way to match the design, but it looks great regardless. She used a red dot fabric for fabric E as it is much brighter than the black. She says again, this is a relatively easy project. So I'm gonna point out to you that this right here, when you get your pattern, it shows it in black, but we thought that there was enough black in the quilt, so let's choose red to brighten it up. So gnomes, as we know, are very popular. As she mentioned in her um, reading here, there are two panels. These two are panels right here, but you could certainly use the fabric and create something else that works for your space. So we have a limited amount of kits on pre-order. So please, if you like this quilt, don't delay because once they're gone, they're gone. And it's truly a special quilt. So let's look at some of the coordinates that we still have available because maybe you want to make a matching pillowcase or two to go with this beautiful quilt. So here is one of the Nomantics prints. We've got gnomes riding deers. Have you ever seen that before? One of my favorite parts about these little gnomes are the prints on their hats. I just think they're so cute. And then this collection does use quite a bit of black, but somehow it works and it's still cheery. Just imagine the gnomes out working at midnight. <laughs> Okay, and then we also have the gnome hats tossed. I think this one would especially be cute for a pillowcase. Fits the theme. And then there is a nice um, diagonal buffalo plaid in a gray color to round it all out. We also have the pre-cuts. So if you're a pre-cut person, don't miss out on these cuties. We still have the 10 inch pack available. Um, if you're not familiar with pre-cuts, these are 10 inch squares of the prints in Nomantics and there's 42 pieces in here. And then we also have a two and a half inch strip pack. And then if you like the five inch squares pre-cut, we have these um, ready for you. A bunch of different buffalo plaids, just the different prints that were available in the collection. Next, we're going to take a look at Christmas Magic by Patrick Lose. And while you're getting a close up, I'm going to tell you a little bit about the designer. A Renaissance man by definition, Patrick Lose has spent his entire professional career being creative in one medium or another. An accomplished actor, singer, artist, illustrator, costume designer, fabric designer, pattern designer, Patrick is always looking for new ways to inspire and bring color to the world around him. He spent 23 years designing cotton fabric collections for the industry's leading companies and now has his very own company, Patrick Lose Fabrics. So Christmas Magic is a collection that features festive snowflakes, peppermint stick stripes, holiday plaids, colorful baubles, gift packages, and more. Don't miss the Mod Santa stripe because it seems to be the most popular. So let's go ahead and start out by taking a look 
at the Mod Santa Stripe. It's amazing. I personally have never seen a Santa like this on a black and white stripe with those fun retro stars. There is so much you can do with this. It's an amazing print and there are a ton of coordinates that go along nicely. So the ornaments and there's, by the way, there's silver metallic in these, which is very, very nice. We've also got the ornaments on a dark background and tossed presents. And then here's an idea. There's a panel included in Christmas magic. And he has, you can make a table topper, you can make mug mats, mug rugs, all the instructions are in the bottom corner. And one thing I've never seen before is that he includes links to his personal tutorials on how to bind or how to do other basic steps of making a project. So that's really nice. And if we, if we run out of these panels, you can always, you know, choose individual coordinates and make the mug mats. So it's nice because this is cut and sew, but there are other things you can do with the coordinates. So let's keep looking. Of course, there are some plaids. Let's clear the way. I'm going to leave us looking at this one because I love it so much. So we have a nice red plaid. It's tone on tone. Christmas wreaths with the silver metallic. Holly. A black and white traditional plaid. We've got those retro stars with the silver background. Silver metallic, I mean. So really, really nice collection. Here's those candy stripes you talked about. And then the green buffalo plaid. So that is Christmas magic. And now we're going to look at Glow from Robert Kaufman Fabrics. Robert Kaufman is thrilled to introduce a new in-house brand called Wishwell. Hailed as fabric for daydreamers, these prints feature a harmonious mix of modern and classic designs and come from the studio led by senior stylists Linda Fitch and Vanessa Stevens. When asked to describe their design process, Linda and Vanessa explain, we visualize the full story from paintbrush to sewing machine. We create quilt focused collections, always considering scale, color, value, and composition. So, Glow is this amazing collection full of bright colors and look at these peppermints. They're amazing. Normally you would see just plain red and white and here you've got the lime greens, the, all the different colors and right away it would look amazing as a Christmas stocking. Um, so let's keep looking at all of these fabrics that make up Glow. Kind of just a different artistic take on Christmas. Christmas trees, this one is unbelievable. I would wanna do something that takes a lot of this fabric so you can really see the full print of the Christmas wreaths and the ornaments and the blurred lights in the background. Um, also on Robert Kaufman's website are some ideas. I love these merry and bright pillows featuring the Glow collection. And they're, this pattern is from a company called Sewn Wyoming, which we will link to you for you. But Sewn Wyoming has an amazing website with a lot more patterns. So definitely check them out. Okay, just a few pieces left in this collection. This one's amazing too, the blurred lights, whether you see them as Christmas lights outside your house or on the tree. This one has scattered peppermints and candy canes. Oh my gosh, look at the colors. Very kid friendly as well. If you're looking for something to do Sewing wise with the family, I think this would be a great collection to inspire young sewers. 
Lastly, we have an exciting opportunity for you locals. Howard is going to be teaching this reversible apron for the holidays class here at the sewing studio, Friday, November 19th from 9.30 to 12.30. The first class filled so fast, we've added this additional date. We wanna let all sewers know that you're welcome. It doesn't matter your skill level. This is a very easy project to make and um, it's reversible. So. First of all, we have the poinsettias on this side, but wait, on the other side are the fall leaves that'll get you through um, Halloween and Thanksgiving, so you can do all your holiday baking with this side, and then flip it over to the poinsettia side or whatever fabric you choose for the Christmas baking season. So once again, um, this is a very easy project. All it takes are three half yard cuts, and the pattern is exclusive to the class, so we hope we'll see you here. And we're gonna link the class to make it easy for you to find. It's an in-store class for beginners or all skill levels. I'd like to thank everyone for watching this series with us. And remember the extra special coupon code is still valid on everything that I've shown here today. And happy sewing.